time to get into a dang thing. Who are you? Fugitives. Just like you. My name is Josh. I'm Simon. North. And you knew that only an android could follow the trail, didn't you? Only those who are like us can find Jericho. If you could decipher the signs, it's because one of us trusted you enough to give you the key. There's a place where we can be free. Find Jericho! I don't understand. I thought Jericho was a place where androids lived in freedom. We do live in freedom. It may not be what you hoped for, but here we have no master. We don't belong to anybody. How many are you? There are 19 of us still in working order. The rest were damaged escaping their masters. Many tried to reach Jericho. Few succeed. Humans have little pity for our kind. I understand how you feel. But we have more freedom here than you ever did. I came to Jericho looking for hope. It looks like I'm not gonna find any here. You're lost. Just like the rest of us. We didn't ask for this. All we can do now is deal with it. You're safe here. You can stay with us as long as you want. Go and see Lucy. She might be able to help you. Are you Lucy? Sit down. Uh, how about I not? Show me. I'll stop the bleeding. Drink this. Get up. Give me your hand.
You had it all. And you lost it all. You've seen hell and now hell lives in you. Your heart is troubled. A part of shadow and a part of light. Which will prevail? Your choices will shape our destiny. Ain't about the creepiest thing. They threw him out when they didn't want him anymore. He was living on the streets before we brought him here. They'll all shut down if we don't find a way to help them. To help them, we need blue blood and bio components. We salvage what we can from those who shut down. But there's never enough. So, how do they survive? They won't. We're slowly dying out. A lot of these guys in pretty bad shape. That's how the humans treat those who disobey. They despise us. They'll never accept what we are. How long have you been here? Four weeks, three days, eleven hours. When I escaped, there was nowhere else to go. Jericho seemed as good a place as any. What was your function before coming here? What do you care? If you came here for comfort, you came to the wrong place.
Simon. I know where we can find spare parts. Cyberlife Warehouse is in Detroit Harbor. They have everything we need. The docks are guarded. We can't just walk in there and take what we want. Humans will never let us. Which is why we won't ask permission. We don't have any weapons. And even if we did, none of us knows how to fight. We can steal what we need without fighting. We'll just get ourselves killed. Maybe. But it's better than waiting here to be shut down. I'm with you. Maybe it's worth a try. Be okay? We'll get some help here. As soon as we'll all be just a bad memory. This is the place. Are you Zlatko? Who's asking? I was told you could help us. I don't know who told you that. You came to the wrong place. I'm sorry. Wait. We really need your help. Come in. Don't be shy. Luther, would you be so kind as to take these ladies' coats? Oh, don't be afraid of our big friend here. Luther is just another android that I helped. He keeps me company in this big, empty old house. Please, make yourselves at home. How did you hear about me? An android. On the street, he said you could help us. I see. Devian, huh? What about her? She's human. And you want to find a safe place. Somewhere you can start a new life. I hear Canada is very lovely at this time of year. Beautiful landscapes, 
open spaces, clean air, and no android laws. Great place for a fresh start. Yes, that's... That's exactly what we want. Of course. Well, I can help you. But first, we have to get rid of your tracker. Tracker? Yeah. All androids are fitted with a tracking device to locate them at all times. I'll remove yours, and then you'll both be safe. Come on. Follow me. Uh, the little one can wait for us in the living room. No, she always stays with me. Of course. Right this way? Everything we need is in the basement. I don't like this place. And that man. Let's go, I have a bad feeling. He's a bit odd, but I think we can trust him. We don't have much of a choice anyway. Please excuse the mess. I need it somewhere discreet for my machines. Removing trackers is illegal, so I opted for discretion over comfort. I hope the little one isn't too scared. No. No, she'll be all right. That's good. This way, please. If you could just stand over there. I should warn you, this could be quite unpleasant. You know what's strange? For some unknown reason, the trackers seem to stop working in Deviants. That's why it's so hard to find them. So, actually, there's no reason to remove your tracker. What? But you said that... Yeah. Uh, people believe what they want. You deviants are so naive. They'll come to me expecting me to help them. And I just reset them, sell them on. Or I keep them for my little experiments. No! No, I, I don't want to be reset! Let me go! Ah! Oh, I forgot about the child. Uh, lock it up. I'll deal with it later. Alice! Alice, no! Wow. A deviant that wants to be a mother. That's, that's so sweet. And so deluded. I think it's time we put you out of your misery. That's what you get for having a dream. It always ends up the same way tears and disillusionment. Believe me, you're better off being erased and feeling nothing. No more pain. No more hopes dashed. I almost envy you. Kara! <laughs> oh, poor little Alice. Oh, looks like Mommy doesn't remember you at all, huh? Looks like Mommy's completely forgotten you. Carl, what <laughs> happened to you? Oh, 
All right, that's enough. Come on. You bit me. I'm gonna teach you some manners, you little bitch. Carl, wake up, Carl. I think that's why I taught in locker. Hmm. Meet me in the living room. This can't be happening. He likes to play with us. Creating monsters. For his amusement. But who's the real monster? Look what he did to us. Yes, Lotto. They should be done here in ten minutes or so. Have a look at the little one, see what I can do with it. Understood, Slako. I'll bring you the little one in ten minutes. Yeah, I thought so. I remember this place. Alice. Car. Car, you remember me. How could I forget you? I'm so sorry. You were right. We never should have come here. We have to go. Follow me and don't make any noise, okay? Yes, Lord. I'm finished. 
finished here. Go fetch the little one. Right away, Zako. making machines out of some damn monsters out of machines deviants my bad You know what? Kinda happy car is dead. You wanna know why? You wanna know why honestly? Because of a couple simple things. I don't have to play as her anymore. And honestly, <laughs> I really didn't like fucking playing as her. So you know what? I'm fond of that. I wonder if she's dead dead and it's like no coming back or something. I mean, I like Car. It's just honestly, Hank, Connor, and Marcus are hell enough for me in this game. I love every single character, especially Connor, Marcus, and Hank more than anybody else in the game. And Car ain't even up there on top. I hate to say it, but I don't care. She ain't on top. She isn't. Car, hell, she's probably not even near on top, especially until the ending. The ending, I'd say she gets near top, maybe top up there. Hello, Amanda. Connor, I've been expecting you. 
Would you mind a little walk? That deviant seemed to be an intriguing case. Pity you didn't manage to capture it. I have no excuse. I should have been more efficient. Did you manage to learn anything? The walls of the apartment were covered with drawings of labyrinths and other symbols. Like the other deviants, it seemed obsessed with RA9. What else? I found its diary, but it was encrypted. It may take weeks to decipher. You came very close to capturing that deviant. How is your relationship with the lieutenant developing? He seemed grateful that I saved his life on the roof. He didn't say anything, but he expressed it in his own way. We don't have much time. Deviancy continues to spread. It's only a matter of time before the media finds out about it. We need to stop this, whatever it takes. I will solve this investigation, Amanda. I won't disappoint you. A new case just came in. Find Anderson and investigate it. Hang on a second, how the hell does she know a new case just came in instantly? Instantly. Wait, that was like Connor when he was getting that, that stuff or the tank. Oh, fuck me. I figure I know what that means, but I'm not saying. Back at Hank's house. I remember last time I did this. Lieutenant Anderson! Anybody home? Great job, Connor. Great job. Great detective work, by the way. Lieutenant Anderson! Easy! Oh, sumo. Sumo! Yep, yep. I'm your friend. Dog easily. <laughs> See? Dog. I know your name. I'm here to save your owner. Oh? Oh, hell yeah. Get this drunk ass off the floor. <laughs> This dude. This dude. Alright, you got liquor, black lamb, alcohol. You got a gun, one bullet remaining. Okay, I know what that means. Anything. What about this? It, oh, is that what? Chest, alcohol, scotch whiskey, and this damn heart. What the hell? A weird thing. Thank you, okay. Lieutenant! <laughs> Wake up, Lieutenant! You already? <laughs> you already for his shit? Pop! It's me, Connor! 
bro. Strap smack, bro. I'm going to sober you up for your own hey, safety. Hey, you have to warn you. Leave me alone, this you fucking android. Get the fuck out of my house. I'm sorry, Lieutenant, but I need you. Thank you in advance for your cooperation. We get the fuck out of here. No, that's a dude right there. Sumo! Attack! <coughs> Good dog. Good Attack! Attack! Bruh. I swear, I know every word. I can't, well, not every word. I forget some stuff. But Fuck! I, I think I'm gonna remember. be sick. Ah, oh, leave me Bruh. alone, you Bruh. asshole! I'm not going anywhere. What the hell are you doing? <coughs> I don't want a bath. Thank you. Sorry, Lieutenant. It's for your own good. What is he about to do? Is it about to be hot or cold? Ah! Ah! Turn it off! Turn it off! Ah! Not hot. Ah! Yes, that's hot. Ah! What the fuck are you doing here? A homicide was reported 43 minutes ago. I couldn't find you at Jimmy's bar, so I came to see if you were at home. <sighs> Jesus, I must be the only cop in the world that gets assaulted in his own house by his own fucking Andrew. No, I ain't too right about that, though. <sighs> Can't you just leave me alone? Maybe you should drop the case. They'll assign someone else, and I can focus on my mission. Your goddamn mission, that's all you care about, huh? Listen, Lieutenant, you're not yourself. You should beat it, you hear me? Get the hell out of here! Damn, slow. <laughs> Jeez. I understand. It probably wasn't interesting anyway. A man found dead oh. in a sex club downtown. Oh, <laughs> Guess they'll have to solve the case without face, us. Bruh. He's like, no, you know, I probably go. wouldn't do me any harm to get some air. Bruh, this dude, this dude. There's some clothes in the bedroom there. Shit. I'll go get them. I should probably. Uh, nah, I think I got enough time to do this. If I don't, I'll just restart it. And, um, cut the, turn the video to where I, I didn't even get on this mission. What do you want to wear? Whatever. Ooh, we get a choice. Streaky, stri stripey, or hippie. Let's go streaky. I go black and white and whatever else. Oh, is that way? <coughs> um, human, Are you human all right, things, Lieutenant? you know. <coughs> yeah, yeah. <sighs> Wonderful. Just, uh, give me five minutes, okay? Sure. President Warren issued an official warning to Russia in her speech to Congress today, where she demanded that all Russian troops withdraw from the Arctic region immediately. The Kremlin has yet to respond, but this is clearly a new escalation in the conflict. Many experts are suggesting the specter of a third world war draws closer every day. It's a kid. What the hell? And it is cold, deceased. Mich Live 115 Michigan Drive. He's sure died. 10 11 2035. Holy oh, shit, it's already 240 then? That is if you died more than four or five years ago, of course. But still, it's at least two, three, five. Sheesh. What were you doing with the gun? Russian roulette. Wanted to see of how course. long I could last. Must have collapsed before I found out. You were lucky. The next shot would have killed you.
Be a good dog, Sumo. I won't be long. I missed two. Um, that was probably one was probably pet the dog. I mean, come on, we all love dogs. Um, no, I'm not doing another. No, sorry, but no. How it's too late now to do another, and this is a big. Well, this ain't that long, but it's too long. Oh, it's like, but it's a fifty-something-minute video. You let Kara and Alice die. Oh, so they both died. How could you do that? Honestly, Rui don't give a fuck. You could have <laughs> saved them. Shut up, bro. They're in your hands. Ooh, yay. The most boringest androids die. Ooh, yay, I'm so sad. Hell no, I'm fucking happy he died, honestly, kind of. Because hell, those are the most boringest androids. Thank God they died, because now I can actually focus on main missions, and I won't have Kara missions to do. So they'll be a lot funner. Here, the Pirates Cove pointless. We got we're not train pointless. We got and that's all. Aside from that, the cell bell for Detroit Crossroads. And Yeah, that's all. So basically cars is the most boring missions if y'all looking for action. So if y'all if y'all came here for action well, now we're gonna most be just be action and not mother figure. Well, that's some weird shit. I don't know what happens. Alright. I'll see y'all later. Peace. It was good making our video. And see y'all later. Peace.